Recording in progress. could join me in a circle. Sorry about the noise. All right, we're going to take a couple of deep breaths and then we're going to chant Ma three times and you do it as long as you can. And when everybody does it right, it starts resonating and it goes up and down your spine. And we're going to send out some positive energy into this universe, which really needs it right now. All right, so deep breath in and out. Just let everything, all your worries go away. Another deep breath. And out. Now when we start doing ma, if you finish before everybody else, just start your next time. And we will all end up at the same time eventually. All right, so everybody ready? Okay. Ma. Oh. 
introduce ourselves. Um, after we do me, we will introduce whoever is on Zoom. So, starting with you. Hey, Nahim. Nahim, welcome. welcome. Charlie. Charlie, Charlie, welcome. welcome. Teapot. Teapot, Teapot welcome. welcome. Judy. Judy, Judy welcome. welcome. Jim. Jim, welcome. November. November, November welcome. welcome. Jeff. Jeff, welcome. Carrion. Carrion, welcome. Aquaria. Aquaria, Aquaria welcome. Sequoia. Sequoia, welcome. Sequoia, welcome. Vincent. Vincent. Vincent, welcome. Delaney, Delaney welcome. welcome. Laurelin. Laurelin, Laurelin welcome. welcome. And who do we have on Zoom? I'm Vanessa. Vanessa, Vanessa welcome. 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 That's it. Anybody else? Okay, and Lakota, welcome. Lakota, <laughs> welcome. All right, mother, mother. We, we are, are here. here. <laughs> All right, and if you can just remain standing for a few minutes, we're gonna in, call in the directions. <laughs> Oh, did I skip something? Yeah, ritual you intent. Skipped. Ah, sorry. First, we will have ritual intent. At Hollow Mass, Breed withdraws her green mantle from the earth. With a last stunning flourish of color, her power withdraws into the ground. The very soil now holds all life. Plants and trees go dormant, and many of the animals are settling in for their long winter slumber. It is Samhain and the veil grows thin. If we peer through the hagstone towards the large standing stones, we could see them vibrate and shimmer, dissolving away, revealing the caliche within. Rising, she takes up her plaid, shakes it, and lifts it up around her shoulders. The threads of her plaid touch the surrounding hills and mountaintops, dusting them with the first snow of the season. The old crone has drawn us into the deep of the year. As the Kalich guides us through our inner realities and dreams, she teaches us to let go of all that no longer serves our higher purpose. She guides us through the many deaths and rebirths of our life phases. She is the final face of the triple goddess who rules the wheel of reincarnation. May we embrace the veiled one Knowing the transformative power of darkness will lead us into the growing light of rebirth. And now we will re-invoke the directions, beginning in the east. <clears throat> we turn to the east, source of breath. Sylphs of air, you are with us in the beginning and depart with us when we leave this realm. Be with us tonight. Blessed be. Blessed be. We turn to the south, the source of transforming flame. Salamander of fire, your brilliant spark guides us through the cycles of life. Be with us tonight. Blessed be. Blessed be. We turn to the west, a place of deep wells and underground springs. Undines of water, you carry us through the ebbs and flows of life on your never-ending tides. Be with us tonight. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. And we turn to the north. A place of soil dark and fertile. <clears throat> Gnomes of the earth, keeper of the earth's secrets. Anchor the energies raised and the guidelines of, the, of power throughout the circle. Be with us tonight. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. We turn to the cosmos, powers of above. <clears throat> Here we find the starry sky, vast and limitless. Seek there the spark of life and the infinity of the universe. Be with us tonight, blessed be. Blessed, blessed be. be. We turn to the caverns and dark soil, powers of below. Burrow well to that quiet place for self-reflection and inner space. Be with us tonight. Blessed be. Blessed be. We turn to enlightenment, powers of within, spiraling inward to the core, 
Find the heart and soul therein, for those are where your dreams begin. Be with us tonight, blessed be. Blessed, blessed be. be. By the power of the witch's staff is the magic circle made, a strong enclosure, a power-filled room, safe within the goddess' womb, a sacred place, a world apart, where energies merge and magic starts. With air and fire, the circle I tread, to know our will is magic, tis said. The fire is lit, the ritual is begun. Ta-da. Okay. stay on. Kalich. I just turned it on. Stay on now. Okay. Kalich, we call to you. Enter your sacred cave with courage and trust, casting aside all worries, laying them down like the stones they are. We come seeking she who is bringer of winter and keeper of the fire. Kalich, we seek renewal in your sacred cave, which provides shelter from the storms of winter. We light this candle to call you forth, wise woman. We come to be nourished and blessed by your presence. Kalich, we welcome you, stone mother. We embrace you, wise woman, with gratitude and openness for blessing us with your presence. Hear my stories and grant us your wisdom. Kalich, blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be. I am the Kalich, goddess of winter, <clears throat> mother of mountains, ageless lady of dark places, ancient crone of wisdom. My reign begins on a cold Samhain night, and I return to stone on Beltane's first light. I am the ancient time itself. When the Celts came to this land, I was already here. It has been asked if I am the one the grandmother who ate the apple in the beginning. But it is not for you to know. I am the spirit of the land, holding sovereign power over the earth. I am akin to the banshee and the wild women of the fae. Watching over the mounds and entrances to their realm, you can find me near the standing stones and the bones of the earth. I am the goddess of transformation and death. I oversee the calling of the old and let die that which is no longer needed. With the passing of the winter months, I find and guard the seeds for the re coming rebirth of spring. I stand at the cusp of life and death, intimately connected to the wise woman who presides as midwives over birthing and who prepare the dead for burial. The winter begins the spring, and in death, I am endlessly renewed. Everyone can be seated now. Thank you. Okay, I am on. Tonight, we <laughs> celebrate the eighth and final spoke on the wheel of the year. For farmers, it was the third and last harvest when all crops must be safely within, as the frost would destroy what was left in the fields. For herders, it was the time to move cattle or sheep to winter pastures, driving them between the fires to purify and protect them. It was time to cull the herds to provide enough food for the cold time ahead, but not so much that the herd would be threatened. It is the end of autumn and the beginnings of winter, the end of one year and the beginning of the new. It is a time for warm fires, good food, good company, and quiet celebration. As we stand at the crossroads of yet another year, it is also time for reflection and to plan for the future. The barrier between the realms grows thin on this night, so it is time to remember and honor those who have passed beyond the veil. We honor our ancestors, our beloved dead, 
and those who recently crossed over. The living and the dead commingle. We talk to departed souls and we learn the mysteries of the underworld. If you have a tea light, and we have some candles here, hold it and charge it with your energy and love. Then light it and remember your ancestors and those who have crossed over. So now, let us call in our beloved dead. We will go around the room and each person is, has the opportunity to come up, light a candle from out of the, co the goblet, and you just, and the candle went out. You can light it off the <laughs> candle and then place it in the sand next to it. 
there was not much wick for me tonight. This candle has now been like joined. There it is. Torch it. Okay. Nahim, would you like to start? Indeed. You can light it off the other one. I light this candle for my sister, Rosemary, my mother, Arlene, my father, Charlie, <coughs> and to honor Harvey Munford, who just passed away. I light this for Brian B and Brian G, who I have been become memory keeper for, and from my mother Suzanne.
हजार Is there someone I can light a candle for you for on Zoom? Uh, I, yes. I'd like, I'd like to light like a candle for my father, father Wayne, Wayne Walker, Walker, and all and my, my ancestors that have come from school, as, as well, well as all those who have served, served here, here in, in my, in my, my work. work. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And I light a candle for my mother, Beverly, my father, Don, my best friend, Sandra, Lady Aislinn, and for Priestess Candace Ross. Lakota, is there anyone you wish for me to light a candle for? I believe that's it. Could you ring the bell, please. What is remembered lives to those whose feet are stilled and those who laugh with us no more. To you we say, our love was with you here and goes with you now to that place where you rest and take delight. May your feet walk along the coffin path to that place where all is fresh and green where lovers, friends, and ancestors wait with open arms to greet you. Go in peace and with our blessings, or remain a while with us this eve. Be rested amongst your own this eve. We pray ever for you, and we will meet again when the wheel turns for us. Pray be there to greet us in that place and we will walk the coffin paths together and bide a while with kith and hearth. Until that time, be near us, our kinsmen and kinswomen, our guardians, our ancestors, our beloved dead. And now we will have our celebration time. And I think we have a special treat this evening our very own teapot has agreed to play some music for us. And I also invite our friends on Zoom, if they have a poem or a story or just something they want to share, uh, your mic will be available for you. And we will go around. And I'll start with you, Edmund. Nahim. Yeah, no. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was just remembering that night that you and she had done. Nope. There's so much this year that's changed. It, it feels like the year that everything fell apart. You know, I ran out of duct tape somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> and it's <Yeah>. just. <laughs> Here's to a new beginning. Right? <coughs> Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be.
Professor B. Mm -hmm. okay, I have, um, it's a little bit practical, so I've, I've prepared for this. Um, so I know that we've been, uh, you know, in discussion about the origins of sour and where it all came from, and we were talking not that long ago between some of us about uh, the Scottish tradition of where dressing up came from. And so, for those of you who don't know, the origins of why we dress up are because people used to dress up back in the day because they would believe that the spirits would walk the streets at night. So if they dressed up, they would be in disguise with the spirits and therefore would not be taken away because if you weren't dressed up, you were potentially going to be taken away. So I wrote a chant about it <laughs> and a song. And so give me one second. Okay, we're going to get the mic in front of you so that everyone can hear little, your beautiful music. I have my little Bluetooth speaker as well that I'm going to put, put on it as well, but it's okay. But it, this is very last minute. <laughs> It doesn't seem to be working. Spread them out, yeah. Just in case anybody wants to. to Did you sing. turn it up? Uh, how, how do I do this? Okay, hang on one second. <laughs> yep, okay. No, 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 it's all good. I got it.
Blessed be. I'll hold my breath because I have no idea what he's going to say. <laughs> Blessed be. Blessed be. <laughs> it has been indeed a year starting with, well, let's see, I was the very last patient in 2022 at the surgery center where I got a pacemaker. So it's been fun learning to live with a pacemaker, which is weird to have some weird thing in your body that they can actually control it from outside me. Yeah, I mean, I go in for a device check and they say, okay, we're gonna slow your heart down and we're gonna speed your heart up. And he's sitting there on the computer doing it. That is really strange. I agree. I'm, I'm just wondering if they're eavesdropping and listening <laughs> in, you know? <laughs> Don't go there. <laughs> so learning to live with that has been very interesting this year. And then, of course, I did what my doctor told me, and don't move your left shoulder. And I didn't, so I got frozen shoulder. So I had two cortisone shots, three months of physical therapy. Really nice physical therapist, really nice. I was actually sad when it left. I brought him a rose. <laughs> so yeah, what else have we done this year? I've argued with my gastroenterologist, and I won. Um, Yay! <laughs> Yay! You managed to keep me straight. Oh, yes. I've managed to keep him straight, which is not an easy job. But that's been 2023, so hopefully this next year is going to be really fun and really nice, and I want to be in Italy next September. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so mode it be. <laughs> <clears throat> That's a tough act to follow, <laughs> uh, but I just want you to know that was truly amazing, and thank you. 2023 probably has been a very uh, dramatic shift for me and my favorite, which to my left, we had a chance to go back to a place where we met. 10 years ago, almost the day. Uh, another to our, our home pagan group. It's still there. It was invigorating. It was wonderful. It was fearful. It was, it was focusing on what is important and what is not. And now I feel as though we at least have an idea about what next year we hope will look. Blessed be. Blessed be. Yeah. Um, one of the things, I, the, the event is called Panthea. Uh, this year was the 42nd Panthea, a uh, consecutive year going back in the years. And I um, was actively involved with it in the 80s. I ran Panthea Thought, and I ran Panthea 8. <laughs> Uh, which was my last Panthea until Panthea 15. And then I didn't go again until Panthea 32, where I met him. And then we got to go back this year. Took part in one of the many things that happen in this beautiful setting in the woods. It, 
you know, the Northeast. Not orange enough, in my opinion. I know I wear a lot of orange, but uh, the leaves were looked more like September than mid-October. But global warming. Um, one of the things I took part in was an ancestor remembrance ritual, and it's the first time I actually got to publicly mention my mother, who passed almost seven years ago now, but you know, I carried her baggie of ashes with me through the moves, but uh, never seemed to be at an event where it was appropriate. And I remembered that I'm sure she was at Panthea once, and the way Panthea works is once you've been there, you're forever a member of the family. Um, and uh, mentioned Brian, uh, Brian B., who was the uh, live-in partner of one of the founders of Panthea, uh, Judy Harrow, who some of you may have even heard of, um, who, you know, passed. And was fortunate and unexpectedly got to uh, say a final farewell to my second husband, Barry, who is also one of the founders of Panthea, who was with us in person, uh, which was kind of unsurprising because he's had health issues and, and will probably be the first of my exes to pass, I, I would guess, within the next year. And next year, he will be the ancestor we're all, of Panthea that we're all remembering. Um, and it reminded me to love the ones who are with us because next year, they may be an ancestor. <laughs> um, blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be. For me, this was a year of the change. I lost. Um, very good friends. We are together on 28 years, 28 years. And so this was a very hard time for me. But now I think I have place for new things in my life. One of these is here in person. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And thank, thank you for the very nice song. Thank you. Blessed be. Blessed be. Um, I think this year has been a mixed bag. There was a lot of stress and anxiety <coughs> and tears, but also a lot of love and laughter. And I feel very fortunate to have um, the people in my life who care about me, because um, I recognize how hard it was. Blessed be. It's been a very imbalanced year. Um, but I have never invited my ancestors to anything or like ask them for anything. Um, partly because I didn't think they would ever show up. But Blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be.
Would anyone on would you on Zoom like to share anything? It's Vanessa, right? Yes. Yes. Hello. Um, um yeah, yeah, I'd like to share, share that, that soon after my dad passed in October, um, um, my marriage died in that 28 years. years. Um, um, and it, and was, it was challenging, challenging but also, also wonderful. wonderful. Uh, uh, I have really, really fully stepped into my sovereignty this year and, and feel, feel completely, completely liberated. liberated. So, so I'm, I'm grateful. grateful. Uh, and, I, and if the feedback's not, not too bad, I'd like to share a poem. Uh, this, uh, is this is from the beginning of our last year, the calendar. The, the poem is called Darkest, Darkest Shadow, Shadow, and it's, and it's by, by the Greek. Greek. When, the when the moon eclipses the sun, sun be, there be there for it. Seek it. it. Go, Go where, where it takes you. you. Hurry. Hurry. Pay whatever, Pay whatever required, required to go into, into the, the dark, dark to see the light, light only visible from the shadow. shadow. Accept, Except claim, claim and alien gifts, gifts rushing, rushing in for you. you. Only, only now. now. Only now. now. Upheaval Up is but another, another word for, for change. change. Thank you. Thank you. Blessed, oh, blessed, be. Be. blessed be. Lakota, did you have anything you wish to share? No, no, I love, I love you. you. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Thank you. Love you. All right. Did anyone else have anything else they wanted to share? Or? I love the panel. Thank you. Can I just jump back in? You may. Thank you. I'm, I'm sorry. I know most of you are aware that I've had a pretty strange month between the last time I was here versus now. Um, my husband's gone through a really um, traumatic event of a sudden cardiac arrest, and you know we're having to drastically change our lives because of it. And he was in intensive care for two weeks, and it was a, a whole thing. And uh, I think since then I've been finding it, find it very difficult to do any solitary magic. So I just really appreciate being here with people because mm -hmm. you know I've not felt magical as I wanted to say. And uh, you know there was a part of me when it was all happening. I was very very as you can imagine, very angry at the gods, but I think it's all made sense. You know, it all came around in uh, mostly out of sort of the realm of scientific possibilities. Has come out as good as he has, and I do think that that is to do with the work that he has done here in Las Vegas with the mutual aid scene and how much we give back to indigenous communities. I asked Kanunos, because I know he's a negotiator, I asked him to talk to the land spirits um, and you know, really fight his case that he's a good person. And it wasn't until I did that he started to get better. And I just, you know, it's made me really, really just appreciate it all, you know. So I just wanted to share that. Thank you. I want to share that I am so grateful that you could be with us tonight and that we are not recognizing Finn as an ancestor tonight. Yes. That will wait for another time. Yes. Blessed be. Blessed be. Yes. <laughs> and I'm also very grateful to have our friend Queria here with us from Germany. Thank you. Yes. And her sister Sequoia, who does live here in Vegas, but that's okay. <laughs> Welcome, and I'm so glad you get to join us tonight. Thank you. Well, if that's it, then we have one last song by Spinner, and then we will thank the directions. And my phone closed.
Yes. Just taking a big breath. <laughs> breath of life, you carry us through life as a constant companion to the rhythm of our hearts. Sylphs of air, thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed be. Fire of renewal, like a brilliant sun, you warm us and remain forever a guiding light. Salamanders of fire, thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. Water of life, you sustain us before birth and nourish us as we grow. Undines of water, thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. Mother Earth, at my journey's end, may I return to rest in your loving cradle. Gnomes of Earth, thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. Spirits of the cosmos, we are grateful for thy presence and the blessings of the same night sky as our ancestors. Thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. Spirits of below, we are grateful for thy presence and blessings of silent inward enlightenment. Thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed be. Spirits of within, we are grateful for thy presence and blessings of inner tranquility. Thou hast license to depart. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. Galich, great ancient grandmother, lady of the deep forest, old witch of the roots and cauldron, we thank you for receiving our burdens guiding us through the crossroads of choice and transforming us in your cauldron. Guide us and protect us always. Blessed be. Blessed, Blessed be. be. The wild dance of the winter wind, the pounding rain swallowed up by the roaring sea, the clouds that bubble and roil as if tumbling out of a great boiling cauldron, the sudden lightning crack in deep, rich, long midnight it bursts through. The brilliant, beautiful, blinding snow that screams through the silver sky or drifts soft and silent as a blanket over the slumbering land. We see Kalich in the storms, and she comes clad in the songs of thunder. So save your seeds, mend your coats, seek the place where something ends, and begins all at once. Let us celebrate the last beautiful moments of the stories we'll let go of and revel in the joys of the stories we'll keep with us. Let us dance to the songs of thunder. Come Beltane, the storm bringer returns to the stone and Bridget takes up the mantle of goddess. In turn, she will give way to the Kalich again at Samhain and so the circle is complete. The seasons ever change and the wheel turns ever onward. Blessed Samhain. And now we will have our closing song. By the air that is her breath, by the fire of her bright spirit, by the waters of her womb, by the earth that is her body. The circle is open, but unbroken. May the love of the goddess be ever in our hearts. Mary meet, and Mary part, and Mary meet again. Thank you everyone for joining us for our celebration. We hope you will be with us again at Winterfest for our winter solstice. Now we will move into the social hall for our food blessing and potluck. If you brought a dish to share, please be sure and take it home with you when you leave. We don't have anywhere to store your leftovers. I'll take leftovers. <laughs> Thank you everyone and let's go have some food. Blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be. Blessed be.
you. Thank, Thank you. you for joining us, Vanessa. Yeah. Thank, Thank you for having me. It was wonderful. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Lakota. Thank you, Lakota. Thank you, Lakota. Let's see, I've got to no fill the pocket. You can stop the recording. Will do. Thank you. Thank you.